The View Issuance File status allows clients to determine if an issue file loaded successfully or failed during validation. This video provides information on how to view issued file statuses and the details of issued items contained in the files. Click on the Check Issuance drop-down menu and select File Status. The issuance file status will default to the current day, but the date range can be easily updated by clicking on the date range and selecting New Dates. The issuance file status displays the file ID, which is a unique number assigned by the system upon receipt of a file. If the file name begins with Manual, it indicates the issue items were manually keyed into the user interface. If not, the actual name of a file loaded will display. Two status columns will display the status and status message, load date and time, number of issue items in the file, and total. Depending on the file status, an explanation for the status displays in the status message column. For example, if a file has a status of failed, the status message column displays the reason for the file failing. The files can be further filtered by selecting the Filters drop-down and entering a file ID and or status, minimum and maximum amounts. If you select the blue bar titled User Instructions, information regarding action that should be taken for certain status values is displayed. To view individual issued items within the file, select the View button. The View File window will display each issued item's account number, serial number, amount, status and load date and time. To return to the file view, select the Close button.